Hi everybody, Bruce Nell here from Traveland RV. Hi everybody. Well, as you might know on my YouTube channel, you've noticed I take a lot of movies on the older ones. Because I like the older ones. You don't need to spend a whole lot of money to have fun. So what we're going to do first, I'm going to go in, show you everything, and then have it walk around outside and uh, tell me what you think. 1992 Pinnacle 340Q. That's by Thor. I'm just having it run because it sounds great. They've taken the cats out. This thing's got lots of power. It runs perfect. Well, let's go inside. Power step. And don't worry about the exhaust being loud because once we get inside, it runs pretty sweet. So I'm going to start from the front. 112,000 original kilometers. It's got power jacks front and rear and are operated by those buttons right there on your bottom left. So you don't have to level the unit, just hit some buttons. The level is right there and away you go. Ford 460 big block motor, tons of power, tons of torque. It's also a four speed automatic, not a three speed, so it gets decent gas mileage on the highway. And I love this, uh, you don't see this anymore, kind of cockpit view. And it looks great. This is a 1992 with no smells, no leaks, no rot. The chairs are in excellent shape. They both swivel around, so I'm going to go do this. Hit the button here. Oh, it's on the other side. Sorry, guys. Swivel the seat around. And there you go. So let's go look at the floor plan here. Again, why I love these is you don't have to spend a lot of money. This is 16900 bucks. All clean, detailed, everything's checked over, no windows leak, there's no rot, none of the windows are blown. Cabinetry's still in nice shape, lots of storage. There we are. Your humidity levels. Couch turns into a bed, and if we see how it works here, you just flip one hand, and there's your little bed. Lift it back up here. Even a 92, we can do it all with one hand. So we have our entertainment area, like this, so the driver's seat can swivel around as well, and there is shades to cover up the front windows. Carpet's awesome shape. This dinette turns into a bed, kitchen, that's your soap dispenser, still a stainless steel sink. This has got a 10 gallon hot water tank in it guys. Most of these old guys have a 6 and generally the new guns have got a 6 gallon hot water tank. This has got a 10. So that means a long shower or if you're doing dishes you're not going to run out of hot water. I mean it's a 92 here so I mean this is a little faded but for the price is that really going to bother you? Oven works. Super nice shape. Stove top works. It's actually got a convection microwave in a 92. So that means you don't even need the oven. Hit convection. Tell it what type of the raw chicken. If it's 20 minutes on a normal oven, this would be 10 minutes at uh, 350 degrees. It's got ducted air conditioning. So the air conditioning comes through here. Which on a lot of the older units, this part here will be air conditioner, that's the only place it comes out from. And also it has a generator, 4,000 watts, which means you could run your air conditioner, all your lights, your plugs, in the middle of nowhere. It's also got two, climate, or two air conditioners as well, so there's one in the back to duct the back out. There's all your adjustments there. Nor cold fridge. It runs off your battery, it runs off electricity, and it runs off gas as well. So it's a true three-way fridge. As we walk through the hallway, extra closets, cedar lined. And again, I should have tested this. No smells. If you've been looking for old motorhomes that have a funny smell to them, that's not just how they are. It means that one time it's leaked or they've lived in it. Bathroom. Yeah, they sealed off in there because it cracked. 
I mean, if you want to replace the whole shower unit, go for it. Or, I mean, seal it up. Don't have to worry about anything. It's got a skylight so you can stand up in it. So it's got lots of room. Toilet's there. Your magazine holder. I don't see that anymore. It's got max air covers over the vents. So that means it's got a cover there so you can have this open and uh, have your fan on. And no rain gets in. Real queen bed. Match is still in nice shape. Storage underneath. Now in this generation, you do need two hands lifted up. So I'll do that for you in a second here. There's your rear climate control. Storage up there. His and hers closets. There's your climate control adjustments there. It does have a privacy curtain. I'll turn this over. So you shut that off so your guests can use the washroom. And this door, when you have it opened up, makes it private as well. Drives great, stops great, generator runs perfectly, everything works. And up in here, just like your newer ones, your generator start is right there. Your auxiliary batteries, so it means uh, if you're drive your, your your sorry your chassis batteries are out you hit the battery button there and it'll start your house batteries so you can start your truck up they've upgraded the CD player so that's an iPod plug-in there's your overdrive button for your four-speed automatic it also has a kill switch for your battery power a lot of these older ones you have to shut every light off individually so you don't drain your battery this has a little pole here so you don't have to shut all the lights off you just pull this switch and they all shut off Excellent features as well. Driver's door, so I don't have to run in the back to get out of the unit. And it's got power windows. And it's got heated mirrors. I like the padded dash. Windshield's in great shape. The fans work perfectly. It's got your old school surround sound in it. It actually doesn't sound that bad. So yeah, just thought I'd do a quick little tour. And if you don't want to just have this door here as your privacy, there's also a privacy cover here. So you can really separate two areas. So if you do have some kids, separate it off. It's got a pull-out pantry right there. More pantry space there. And we'll go on the outside. It's actually quite slick. There's that power step working. So pull these storage things out, give you an idea what you got. So you got storage there. It's got a newer awning. So that's been replaced. Tires have been replaced. Listen to that thing. Tires are Michelin's and are in excellent shape. There's your 10 gallon hot water tank there. More storage here. But back in these older units, it was great because you had a trunk. Look at that. Roof's in great shape. It's got an attic, so it's got a breather right there. More storage here. It's got a black water flush, so it flushes out your uh, toilet tank, so you don't have to do it manually. You just literally hit a garden hose, hook it into here, open up your sewer, which is down here. So literally pull the black, turn the garden hose on, and it flushes out that tank so you don't ever have any smells. Over here, there's the generator, Conan, it's got 900 hours on it. These go for about 20,000 hours, so we got some time, and it runs perfect. More storage, and yeah, it's got some flaws, I mean, if you want to redo this, but all the seals are good, again, for the money, use it for a couple years, come back, upgrade something different, but that's tons of fun. Oh, and I love the searchlight. See that light right there? That's got an adjustment inside, you can turn it, so you can aim where you want it to go, so if you're trying to park at night, you can light up the whole area. Pretty cool. And if traffic's getting bad, it's got little ramming bars right there, gotta like that. 
I know it's used for a different reason, but uh, let's have some fun here. So yeah, Drew Snell traveling. Thanks for watching. And uh, if you have any questions, give me a call. I'll have my contact information below. Take care and goodbye.